gonna be today. We're gonna be talking about uh, gem knights in this video. Particularly, we're gonna be talking about gem knights, raffinite, and we're gonna be talking about problematic cards as well in this video. A series in which I only do I only did once before, uh, but I'm gonna be doing a lot more because I think there's a whole there's a ton of cards that I want to talk about that should possibly receive a limit or a ban on the list. Uh, but let's just jump right into it because we've got a lot to talk about here. We're going to talk about Gemini Seraphonite in this video today. And Gemini Seraphonite, in my opinion, is one of those cards that is very comparable to two cards in the game. Uh, one of them is currently limited, and that is Elder Entity Norden. It's very comparable to what it actually does, and it's very comparable in material wise to El Shaval Construct, which is a card that is currently banned, but it was banned because of its uh, accessibility um, in other decks, as well as it being really, really good. Um, so for those of you who don't know what Gemini Seraphonite is, for some reason, or just need a reminder, it requires one Gemini monster plus one light monster. Very similar to Construct because it just replaced Shadal monster with Gemini monster. It's very easily. Um, must be first. It must first be special fusion summon with the above fusion materials, uh, material monsters. So basically, you can't instant fusion this card. You have to summon it through Blinant Fusion or Gemini Fusion or however else you're going to summon it that requires a fusion. You can summon this through Polymerization, uh, and it would still can be considered pretty fast. You just can't use uh, Instant Fusion. Uh, when this card is face up on the field, once per turn during your main phase, you can normal summon uh, a, a monster in addition to your normal summon or sets. You can also set cards in this. It doesn't say this in Wanjiro Pro, but the official ruling on this card and the official text on this card allows you to set cards. Um, have a judge ruling say that too, that, you, that allows summoning, because why would it not? But, uh, uh, but basically, but that's not really important. Basically, what this card does is that it allows you to perpetuate a faster game state and allows you to get more and more advantage through the cards that you play. And uh, ultimately, it's really a card that kind of it's, it just inherently is bad for the game already. I think that cards that just inherently put uh, perpetuate this uh, one card uh, game set where you just make a bunch of ridiculously big boards and. Uh, sit on it just because of one monster on the just because you summon one monster from the extra deck is really ridiculous and I think uh, Norden and Seraphonite are both on the same rank I think both of them should kind of be banned but in this video we're specifically going to talk about Seraphonite because of what it does um, uh, particularly and I'll discuss Norden in a later video but uh, we'll talk about this here some people might actually be wondering why I want why Brilliant Fusion shouldn't be banned because Brilliant Fusion is actually kind of crucial to Gemini's in itself you don't really need to run Seraphonite in Gemini's uh, but you can. Uh, it's, you probably only play one, and in when you do play one, you probably already you probably just go to use it for the normal summon and just be done with it, and you fusion summon it away anyway. And Gemini by itself is inherently a lackluster deck by itself. I'm not saying it's bad. It's just it's not it's not meant for a competitive play right now. Um, however, I think really fusion in in Gemini is very very crucial for the deck because it's kind of one of those cards. It's kind of like Black Warwind in. Um, in Black Wings, you kind of need to play three of that card to play this deck. You kind of need to play three Relent Fusion to play Gemini's, though it's possible, but it's very difficult to do. Um, it's also, I think, very comparable to like Blue Genium Auto or um, Far From Mission Tenki in most uh, Beast Warrior decks. Uh, you kind of have to play those, car those cards for it to kind of matter. Uh, it's very comparable in that aspect. So I do believe that Brilliant Fusion is perfectly fine because it's only really useful outside of uh, Gemini's just to make Seraphonite, and it's only useful in in, in Gemini's outside of that fact. Um, so do keep that in mind that Brilliant Fusion is not the issue here, it's uh, Seraphonite because Seraphonite is, uh, is really easily accessible in a lot of decks. All you need to do is just play two Garnets, one or two Garnets, a Light Monster, and you have this good to go. I think you can play this in True Draco as of right now because you could probably just throw in three Brilliant Fusion and a Garnet and then just get an extra normal summon. I don't think that's very viable though, but it is possible that you could do so. And I think in, inherently there are going to be a lot of archetypes that are going to be wanting to use Gemini Seraphonite because of that, uh, because of uh, the fact that it makes like summoning a little bit, a, a lot more easier than it is now. And I think that kind of bolster should kind of just be uh, eliminated from the game right now until we kind of just are until we're just at a state where okay we can we can speed up the game a bit uh, over the course of the game, I think I don't think Gemini is is a card that uh, or Seraphonite should be a card that is permanently banned, but I think it should be one of those cards that should be banned for right now just to test the waters of the league summoning format and just to test the waters of the sword format. But I want to know what you guys think about the, the about this in the comment section down below. So anyway, guys, tell me what you guys think about uh, Gemini Seraphonite in the comment section down below. I'll see you guys in the next uh, video in the next episode of the series. Uh, I will see you guys in the. Uh, this has been Team Metamorphose, and I'll be signing out.